Today we're talking about cutting corners. What's up? Over the past two weeks, I've actually been asked several times about how to cut corners in leather work. And no, I'm not talking about taking dumb shortcuts. I'm talking about literally cutting the corners off of things, making them nice and round. It's one of those things that is a super basic leatherworking skill, but everybody learned it somewhere, right? And if you're like me, you don't like a squared off corner on your leather. So this is something that you're gonna be doing a lot. Okay, so diving right in. If you have an extra 10 or $15 to spare, the easiest way is just to buy a set of these cheap Amazon uh, corner punches. That's literally all there is to it. And it works on single layers of leather as well as thicker like finished pieces once uh, it's all glued together. Or even if you have your template down on a sheet of leather and you just wanna do the corners instead of cutting around it with your knife, that is gonna be the easiest method. It's one punch with the mallet and you're good. No uh, slowly going around it or anything like that. And there are a bunch of affordable options on Amazon that are gonna work just fine for this. You don't need anything too fancy. And these sets will vary quite a bit in price, but honestly, I still use a pretty cheap set and it works great. I paid under $20 and most of the time I only use one of the punches out of the set anyway. One pointer I would give you if you are ordering these off of Amazon is that you make sure that you get a set that only has the bevel on the outside of the punch. Mine is beveled on the inside as well and although that's okay for punching through a single layer of leather, it kind of slips off when I'm doing multiple layers of leather together and just makes it so that I have more work to do when I'm sanding it down. I just kind of got to clean up the edges a little bit more. Okay, the next method isn't nearly as easy, but it's also not hard and it doesn't require you buy any kind of extra tools. You literally go grab some change out of your cup holder in your vehicle and you can use that. All you need to do is mark your round edge around the coin with your awl. And now you're just going to use your knife and just make shallow cuts along that line that you just marked. And the more cuts you make, the smoother it'll be in the end. After you clean up this edge with sandpaper, you're left with a pretty nice rounded edge. Didn't take too much more uh, time or effort than using the punch. Honestly though, just buy the punch. If you found this one helpful, please consider subscribing to the channel and checking out some of my other videos. I post once a week and I have a bunch of other videos that I think you guys will find helpful. Any questions, leave them down below in the comments for me or send me a message on Instagram or an email through my website contact form. But that's it for today, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.